Hello, Phenomena! Welcome, how are you? Two, 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 two. So we're gonna go all the way, all the way to the back here. To the back of the city. And that's where the guy is, right there. Hello. Oh, it's you. Did you manage to find that rainbow rock salt? Yes, I did. Lost hands over the rainbow rock salt. You did? Oh, that's great. Can I have a look? That's strange. It looks just like normal salt. Let's see how it tastes. Oh, oh my goodness. This is sensational. It's sweet and sour. A little bit spicy? Oh, it's just wonderful. It tastes of absolutely everything. This isn't uh, any other season that can compete with this in depth and complexity. I say Rainbow Rock Salt deserves its reputation. I think it's going to open all sorts of new culinary venues for me. I'm so glad I came all this way for, to get one, get some. I have to say, I don't blame those monsters for setting up camp down in this cave either. I had to supply, I had to supply this stuff on tap. I don't think I'd ever leave either. Thank you so much for going, uh, going down there to get it for me. Here, take this. You've done my culinary career no end of good. I'm sure of it. Ten chunks. A mithril ore. I don't know if I need it, but I want it. Okay, good, good, good. <sighs> Alright, what's the next little bit that we gotta go, go off and do? Or better yet, is there any little, little things here? Oh, there's a magic door that we did not get. How dare I? Oh, it's right there. I never seen this door. I actually never seen this door. Wow, that's actually a well hidden door right there. So through here, nothing. But down here, babushka. I didn't I never saw this magic door. Would you look at that? Look at that maps pays off. Yeah. Yeah. And grab. Ooh, Secret of Silversmiths, cool. I'm liking what I see, liking what I be. All right, all right. Hmm. It doesn't look there's anything that's too valuable to go get. So what's our next stop? Nobody knows, because I honestly don't know. Um, We gotta go back to Cool Office to give a shattering thing. Uh, we gotta go back to, um, uh, La, La Pichol. Go back to Gondola to give it to the girl. Okay. We have to go back to there. Head back to Port Valor. And... Head back to La Economy. Yeah, that's all the ones I have. So we're gonna go back to two little places, three little places, and then La Economy is gonna be the, our last stop for all our our adventuring needs for side questing stuff. And then we're gonna continue on to the main story and finish the game, hopefully. <laughs> um, bear in mind, I still don't know rightly how far we are actually in the game. I just know our trophy spacing seems to be good. Uh, so there's that. Up further up who? We need to go to Galapis City, I believe. Should be our first stop, yes? Yeah, let's go to Galapagos City first. Trails of Cold Steel 1 and 2 are coming to PS4 in the West. Ah, oh, god dang it, I already have it on the PS3. Why is this happening to me? Pretty good game, it's very long though. I'm more than aware that they're they're long. I was trying to play Trails of, Trails of Steel. Ah, uh, but just, they were too long. I was trying to do that last year, actually. Look at like we're back, back with Jacku. I right, just need to talk to this guy real quick. Uh, hello, scholar man. I can't prove my any, my theories until I perform the necessary experiments. I simply can't do that without a lantern shot. Hmm? Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see you there. Wait, does this mean you found a lantern fragment for me? There you go. You have. Oh, thank you so much. I'm starting. I'll start preparing my experiments right away. But, but these are... Oh gosh, now this is fascinating. You see that ruins are the shard you brought me. The same ones that are on those ruins of the desert. 
the ones that are said to date from ancient times. This reinforces my theory that Erwin's lantern contained the power of the ancient hero for whom it was named. The meaning of the ruins is a bit more mysterious, though. It's something like, entrust to you people of the future. But what does that mean? Did Erwin entrust us with his powers? I'm going to need to research this, uh, in a lot more development. This lantern shard could potentially lead to some really groundbreaking discoveries. Thank you for going all the trouble for getting it for me. Here, a little token of my gratitude. Three agats of evolution. I have no idea what that is, but thank you. Thank you for this. <sighs> Alright. Wait, hold on. No. Uh, uh. We're, we're looking this way because just in case. We had to look extra detailed on our maps. Bushka. Bushka. Alright. Uh, Pentacolondola. Gondermalondera. Oh no, we haven't yet, actually. That's the that's the point. We could definitely just like go over that way, couldn't we? It was gone over else. Condola, that's a worse Port of Valor. Port of Valor was the other one. Let's go to Port of Valor. Off we go! Yeah, I, I, I had them for me. I had I decided to get Trails of Steel because you told me how good they were. And I was like, I need to make sure to get these games. Uh, but the way that I decided that was a very simple... Like, were they on sale? How much were they for? And I got one... I, or I got something. <sighs> Alright, let's go finish this up real quick first. <sighs> Yo, I know this wasn't that long. Quick here. Is that it? That that's all the ones? Yeah, that's all. Everything else is just like a whatever situation. So he's just up here. He's not too too far away. Hello, old man. <laughs> you do not need to say anything, amigo. Nada. I get to see from your face you're done as I asked you. You have done a great service to the cause of chivalry and to the reputation of caballeros everywhere. Except the small reward for favor. A metal slime shield. Ooh. Aye, Prioris Moi Trisse. The tail of the uh, knight a bear. It's very sad, no? To be turned into a monster. To forget everything in which you once believed. A knight's word is his bond. His kingdom is master. He serves the weak entirely. Challenges the strong unflinchingly. And never retreats in the face of adversity. A caballero must live by these principles, amigo. The thought that they uh, could be forgotten is frightening indeed. Well, would you look at that? <laughs> I'm very glad this is a very simple, lucky bit that I got right there. <sighs> I'm really surprised how fast that one went. Okay, so now I'm gonna go to Gondola. And Gondola might even have some more side quests we don't even know about. Rainbow Rock Salt reminds me of something. Uh, I had a curry at least recently called uh, she mean <clears throat> apricot. It wasn't spicy at all. It was sweet and creamy. I loved it. Oh. Huh. Okay, that's pretty cool. I never did see those creamy little, little things. Okay, so... Oh, there's several places that I could go check. Also, what the heck is that right there? What are those things? I have no idea. Oh, they're boats. That's what they is. They're boats! Okay, there's one right there. There's a gray one that I can't open. And what else? There's one over that way. Okay, so we'll go look at both those side quests real quick like. I know I have done one. I don't know where the other one is, though. So all the way over here. Are you the one to ask for it? Si, senore. Mmm. Uh, could it be you find my desert rose? There you go. Mmm. You have brought it for me. Santa Celio. 
is made of crystals. Ah, uh, Madre, uh, Madre Nature, uh, Mother Nature, she creates so many miracles. At last I have seen what my lover wanted to give me. It's, it's beautiful. Not a blessmo. And it also is a symbol, see? A symbol of how life always emerge and prevail. It's straight, signore. When I look at this flower, I think I can hear the voice of my lover speaking to me. He tells me to enjoy my life. See, he is correct, no? This world is full of miracles. I must enjoy them as much as I can. Then perhaps I tell my lover of them when we re reunited at last. Grazie mille. Signore, I feel much stronger now. Molto puoi forte. Prego. Take this per favor. Uh, it's not so much, but I want you to have it. I got a happy hat. It's a very happy hat. <laughs> All these foreign words. Yep, I'm not good at with them. Oh, oh no, the truck is here too. Run for it. Go for this one, actually. Of course, garbage truck stand is here. Just, just ready for the, for the taking and whatnot. Ugh. Garbage truck sand, why you gotta come at a time like this? Anyway, as I was saying before, Flippy, Trails of Steel 1 and 2 I decided to get. I forgot when I got Trails of Steel 1, but I know I got 2 on clearance, because I was like, I need to get this. I need to go and get it. But now you're saying that's being released on PS4, it just makes me go like, should you get anything on the PS3, really? Because everything's being released from the PS3 onto the PS4. And it makes me kind of mad. I'm just like, why? Why even bother? I swear. But I was gonna play it last year for that way I could play this year as the year of the sequel for Trails of uh, Cold Steel 2. But it's like a 60 hour long game on top of like the fact that it was like around November when I was able to play uh, that given game to begin with. So I was just like, you know what? Nah. It's gonna be too much. I mean, it's gonna be too, too much. So I just decided to stop. Garbage, uh, Garbage uh, Chan is my favorite streamer. Okay. <laughs> well, I'm glad you know. My copy of Nino Kune 2 still hasn't arrived. It took them uh, a week to send it. Oh dang! And my thing freaking showed up almost instantly too, which I find hilarious. Because I remember getting that uh, a game that you wanted, the Tempest game, like. Pretty much, you told me the day of, and I like I sent it the day of, and like it arrived like less than a week later, which is kind of insane, or something like that. I swear. Get away! I was glad. I'm glad that you got it. That's for sure. Oh, I know who this guy is. He's this, this, the guy that has like a sage thing. You have his little quest thing, right? I want you to find a sage stone. Uh, it's the most uh, particular treasure. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Yeah, he, he's looking for the stage jump. I, I don't have anything else here. Alright. Oh my god, did this develop? So you see, beneath the sea, there's uh, how things have to be. Uh, he who swims beside me can be friend, philosopher, or even food. To tell the difference, one miss must be shrewd. Ah, to see you uh, makes me merry. Very well, uh, meet Luminary. Uh, we brothers three have come to see this place as the place to be. These land livers uh, love uh, to listen as I lecture. I do so enjoy to deploy the wisdom of the deep. I see the sea is back to how it used to be, and all thanks to the dunks that you landed on the slithering sea lizard. We owe you all, uh, you the ocean. Because I want a signal of universal, I always I think I know everything about it. How to be a man? No, I know nothing. This man from the sea, he teaches me so much. He teaches me how the big is the whole world, how deep is the sea, how I can call myself a man if no has such knowledge, eh? Before I think that one thing, uh, Signor, uh, Signor Universal is multi important, but the mad mestizo. He showed me that I was so, so wrong. Now the scales, they fall from my eyes. I see everything. I can't believe this actually developed. That's like a thing. 
Look, he is unbelievable! The man from the sea, he gave the advice of how to win Senior Universal Competition. But it's a big, big mistake. He should not give advice to others. We should enter La Competition himself and win. Oh, I heard about you. You heard... I hear that you defeat Alazrin, the servant of Lord of Shadows, see? Then I must say to you, Akrasim Mile. You hear about that visitor? Eh, see? The people from the sea, they like Gondola a lot. They wish to stay here with us. They have a huge amount of wisdom, I think. Perhaps we could use this wisdom to bring the life back to our city. Ain't that weird? They went from, like, being scared of these people to just, like, like, hey, we're gonna learn from them and stuff. Just a little, little weird little, little scene that you see. That's nifty. Yeah, on average, uh, stuff between North America and the UK takes roughly a week and a half. That is kind of crazy. Everything gets getting ported in new generations. Well, I just don't expect, like, all these games to be constantly ported. Like, I really, really do not. Like, the PS4 out of every other system out there has gotten the most ports of any given system out there. And I will fight anybody about that, because that is the bloody truth. It has God of War 3 on there, it has freaking um, Yakuza Kiwami on there, it has freaking the Trails of Steel uh, 1 and 2 on there, which is just like, okay. Nah, I don't need to park on there. What I'm actually doing right now. Oh, hey, I didn't notice that you can see that from over here. That's pretty cool. <clears throat> oh, no! A group of animals have appeared. Uh, let's attack. Oh wow. Yeah, there's like five enemies. I have to like scroll down and do that. Like a poor. Uh, we'll just do Pink Typhoon because that gets everybody. There you go. <laughs> he got everybody. But just the PS4 has gotten like so many freaking ports. It's kind of freaking ridiculous. But I do want to see if we can go to Nautica again, because Nautica was destroyed. And because we did destroy um, the servant of the, the ocean, I want to see if we can actually go back in or not. That's going to be like my last like thing that I go do before I go do anything else. Ah! Jerk. Why you do this? Why why you do this to me? Why? Stop. Oh, I should have hit that guy if I was going to crit. It's fine, Harvest Moon. Oh, Harvest Moon. Duh! I was like, why? Why did that do nothing? Alright. Whoa. Extablorsion? Causes an enormous explosion that engulfs all enemies and deals extra damage to demons. Um, heck yeah, let's see what this does. I haven't seen it. Oh! Look at that! Oh! Oh! Wowzers! That was really cool. And you can just steal, right? There you go. Dead crap. Well, dead that crap. Was easy. Um, Vita, does the Vita have even more ports than the PS4? No, it doesn't. The PS4 has more ports than the Vita. For a number of reasons. But if Nautica was quote unquote destroyed, and then we destroy the person that was destroying Nautica, does that mean Nautica has come back? I would like to think so. We are able to go down here, right? Ah, oh, God. My hair is getting all kinds of tingled up with my headphones. Ugh! I hate when that happens. Um, it looks like it's fine. We meet again, dear Luminary. Good to see you well. You have our thanks. You saved us from the lizard spawned from hell. If you should miss the air above, just tell me I'll send you. I have the power to summon bubbles, one of which I'll lend you. Well, my friend, what say you? Shall I put my plans in motion and send you back in your ship back to the surface of the ocean? You're staying then. In that case, not to cut us through the cave. I hope you have a fine time in the land beneath the waves. So it looks like we could just straight up go back here. Everything's fine again? Um, yeah. We're, we're fine. Welcome all to Nautica, the realm beneath the foam. Your Queen Marina's honored guest, so make yourself at home. 
and not for you, uh, we would have st had to stay for away forever. We thank you, Luminary, for your tireless endeavor. Well, thank you. Th thank you for that. Can we actually order from the Shark Man now? Because that's what I want to do. Hello, Shark Man. How are you doing? Why? Every time I want to talk to the Shark Man, he's like, oh, I can't actually tell. Oh, I hate this so much. Ah, oh, it's such a such a tease. Looks like there's like a thing I could go up there, but I can't go up there. The heck? Um, hello. Your human guys is certainly a sight for sore eyes. Don't you find it difficult to navigate the waters of Nautica by walking? Perhaps if you petition the queen, she might magic those uh, long limbs of yours to something more suitable for swimming. Okay, I guess you could talk to the queen. Is she back? I thought she died. I cannot swing, sing as sweetly as the boy, my friend, and nor you. But if you'd like to hear the song, I'll see what I can do. Farewell to thee, dear contestant stage. Goodbye, cake shot, goodbye. I'm bound for Octagonia, my humble wares to pry. I'm bound for Octagonia by the way of Sir Rust Town. I'll write to thee a letter, love, when I am homeward bound. So fare thee well when I return, unite we will be. Leaving gondolas not what hurts my love, it's leaving thee. I mean, okay, but... Uh. Hey, what's up? How wonderful is to see you here beneath the sea. The queen has been awaiting your arrival anxiously. Her majesty is above us, but we have no stairs to climb. I could take you up there, though, if now is a good time. Just take my hand, I'll take you up, as simple as can be. So tell me, are you prepared to meet Her Majesty? Very well. Ah, uh, then, hold on tight. We won't want you to fall. A moment swim and we'll be in the Queen's audience hall. Okay, so Queenie, you're back, and you're, you're completely fine. Let me thank you on behalf of the Ocean's Daughters for seeing to Azrigan's removal from our waters. I feared the flame of hope was quenched by misery and pain, but thanks to you it blazes in my subjects' hearts again. Though Egisel has sunk into earth, her will lives on with you. Heed the counsel of our heart and see your mission through. Remember, though the paths we walk are filled with twists and turns, all roads lead from the tree of life and to the tree return. I've been Marina's uh, personal protector ever since she was a tiny tot. And what a lot of headaches that girl gave me. To think the Lake Queen's naughty little daughter would one day safely steer Nautica uh, through the stormiest of waters. It's enough to bring a uh, tear to my weary, blurry eyes. How wonderful to see you back here on the sea, our bed, Sam. But are those lakes not better built for the walking on the land? Not only that, I'd love to see that big blue face once more. Shall I change you back into a fish you were before? An excellent decision. Come then, I shall grant your wish. And then thrice you shall become a beautiful blue fish. Oh, cool, so we can become a fish again. There, you are a fish. But if you're tired of swimming free, I could change you right back if you come and speak to me. Alright, I'm a fish again. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, descending. Burp, 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 burp. This is pretty cool. Yeah, the freaking beeping and whatnot. Of course, the garbage truck sound has to be here all the time. Even in the ocean water. Even then. Uh. Oh, God. I want to go up here. Because there's a side quest up here that I could go do. I want to see it. Hello, Mr. Turtle Sam. How are you? It's been almost, yes, 600 years since the world terrarium was uh, founded. I was hoping to mark this university by failing a new um, exhibit. An item that I first saw when I was mm, still a fresh faced hatchling. Yes, it caught my eyes as I made the perilous journey from the beach to the uh, ocean. Alas, I have been unable to find such a treasure on the ocean floor. Mm. And being a sea turtle, uh, 
I cannot go to the world about to retrieve it. But you, young man, oh, you can travel freely between the ocean and the land. Will you assist me? Yes, I could acquire the exhibit of my dreams. Well, my boy, will you journey to the world above and bring me back? Um, this truly startling treasure. Um, sure? You will truly you are a kind soul. Very well. The items that I seek is a very unique in shape. Almost like a long, uh, like this kid. I only caught a brief crease with it. And here she goes. Um, it was a top of cliff that towered above one of your human villages. It was black and glossy. And large enough to fit a mermaid inside. But then... Just as I was admiring its beauty, bang, it produced the clap of a blast that sent a shockwave running across the surface of the sea. Oh, it took me my breath clean away. Ever since the day, um, that enormous explosive sleek black squid has never been far from my heart. If I had any idea of where such an item might be found, uh, could you bring one back to me from the world above? It'll be the perfect exhibit, yes, to celebrate the 600th anniversary of the founding of uh, uh, the Royal Terrarium. I am counting on you, Luminary. Uh, marking a, mon a monumentous occasion. Of course, he has to give me like the weirdest description of an item ever. Uh, at least I'll be able to talk to the shark, right? Please tell me I can talk to the shark. Oh my, oh my god, yeah, that... <laughs> okay, what do you got here? Alright, well, what can I buy from you, buddy? Oh, look at this! Oh, that's a Nipto Boomerang! What do you got here? Oh, sir, uh, Siren Staff? Uh, not enough, on, oddly enough. Triple Time Whip? That's pretty cool. Dragon's Claws? <gasps> a Quartus Coat? Yes, let's give him the Quartus Coat. Yes, 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 yes. Yes, equip to him. Equip that to him. Ooh, I think you got a new item. New thing. Um, let's, let's get you this too. Mr. Grandpa Man. There you go. And a flowing dress. Oh, pretty, pretty, pretty. Um, humbles and oddly enough, nothing that we can. Alright, cool. That's good enough for me. Cool, cool, cool. So we did get some stuff. Uh, so you can use both like sword and armory, right? Yeah, he, he did both for us. Okay. Uh, change level. <gasps> There's another one right down there. There's another side quest, everybody. We gotta go. We gotta go. We gotta go see that side quest, too. Oh, -ho. let's talk to you. What, what do you have to say? I am the legal counsel of the merman on the stand. He's been accused of floating, uh, a floating, uh, Nanatka's supreme command. He saw a tasty looking fish, and by his own admission, he sank his teeth into it without asking its permission. I need to show the judge he's not a criminal at heart, but hatchling lawyer that I am, I don't know where to start. If I could read my mentor's case, uh, books, even just a little, I'm sure that I could build a case to safeguard his acquittal. I need to go and borrow them, but now the court's in session, I cannot leave. Uh, my client sealed, uh, my client sealed his fate with his confession. If only I could quote those notes, I'm sure he'd go free. Oh, Luminae, will you go and bring them back for me? Um, yeah, sure. Oh, thank you, Luminae. You're as kind as kind can be. My mentor was an ace attorney famed throughout the sea. If I was to follow in his footsteps, then I studied law. Uh, alas, he left us long ago, and now lives on the shore. He built a hut on two, upon a tiny island to the west, and hid himself away in self-inflicted house arrest. As you may surmise, he was an odd, unsocial sort, but also kind at heart, and a true minstrel at the court. If you could ask him for his notes on all the trials he stood, uh, I may yet, yet uh, give the chance to prove the loss something I'm good at. 
<clears throat> Justice is brightened. Okay. So I think I know who where that person is in particular. But we really don't need to go like go see that and whatnot. As for other things, level change, level change. No, it's just those two. So there's two side quests there that we could go do. Um, I know where one is. We're not going to go do it because it's going to take too long for what I want to do. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and... Actually, can I just leave? It looks like I could just leave. Um, where else do I need to go off to? I need to double check my things. My quest logs and such. Yeah, I'm not going to go do this right now. Uh, delay diploma. Yeah, we're, we're good on everything else. We're going to go to our last little bit here. And uh, go do that. So it is all the way right here. La Kaname. That's cool. So we don't have to like go back and change in the fish outfit or whatever. That's good. <coughs> ah. I'll just imagine gar a garbage truck with a huge uh, pink bow floating uh, through the, wa the water. Beep beep. I don't think this turtle can be trusted. <laughs> oh, no, most definitely not. On top of that, the turtles make me yawn constantly. I hate that. I hate it. I hate it. I hate it. I hate yawning constantly. Because then when I yawn constantly, I keep yawning. It just... I hate it. I hate it so much. <clears throat> God. On top of that, other, other things, too. Ugh. Ah. And we're finally here to the last little bit and pieces that we need to go do. Hello, Missy Missy. Hola again, mon cher. Do you have any luck in finding Lilian and giving her the diploma? Um, yeah, actually about that. Oh, is that so? I was too late then. I remember the people as a rust uh, were scattered far and wide after the kingdom fell. Many could not find the strength to carry on. But Lilian, Lilian I was always a dirt and cure. Oh, you say? A real tough cookie. She did what she had to do uh, to make sure her family pulled together. Merci, mon, uh, Monsieur. Thank you for delivering the diploma. Now I can finally retire since regrets. Uh, I want you to take this. It is only on petite choose. Uh, a little thing, but I hope that uh, it helps you in your own way. A uh, gear that glitters. Oh, like gold. Better shoot some stars, man. There we go. Get that too. Uh, okay, cool, cool, cool. And then we have this one over here. Let's go talk to you real quick. Hello again, did you find my daddy? Have you brought me back a bottle of uh, purged perfume? Oh yes, I did. Uh, that was... Yeah, uh, well... Here you go, girl. That's it! My daddy's sacred formula! Oh, I don't know how to thank you! You saved my life! Here, you should take this. It's the least you deserve! You made me the happiest girl of the whole wide world! <laughs> A Hades helmet. Thank you for that, I guess. We're just completing these one by one, aren't we? Pushka. Oh, it feels good. Feels so, so, so good. Also, I could do one part of her thing here. The the lady's uh, little riddles. Which, honestly, I'm surprised I, I didn't like get the first one at all. She basically said, a sword that you steal steal. I mean, honestly. she better than this. Oh, so you think the answers, uh, do you? Let's see. That's it? Your exercise? Uh, the answer, Traveler? You worked it out. The single handed sword that sounds like you should pilfer it is a steel broad sword. Get it, steel broad? Steel sword. <laughs> not bad, not bad, but the game's not over yet. I got another perplexing problem for you. This one's uh, like a short-tempered catapult. It's particularly prickly. All right, here we go. 
Riddle me this. What sort of weapon sounds like it's made to frustrate something that's flagging? If you think you know the answer, equip it and come and show me. Equip it and come and show you. Okay. Thank you.